Well, a little further down on the stand, in fact, it was hidden behind one of the desks until a moment or two ago, and it's attracted a lot of attention already. DB, right number, right number plate, <laughs> which somebody has been adding lots of things to. Yeah, very interesting car indeed. A uh, gentleman that owns this car, British gentleman, drives it round London and uh, wanted to enjoy all of the features of the real Bond car. Has adapted it in many ways, including rotating number plates, uh, there's an ejector seat, oil slick, all sorts of bits and pieces inside. So very nicely done. And of course, most importantly, this car's left-hand drive, which is incredibly unusual for a DB5. Indeed, yeah, but this car's not being sold here. This is a future sale. Yes, indeed. We have a sale in about four weeks' time in Essen at the Techno Classica show. Mm. So we've brought the car along here to this important event just to showcase it along with a number of others that we've got coming up for auction. Indication of costs for that on? I mean, they're fetching serious money now. These days? Yeah. yeah. And certainly the features will appeal to a, a Bond enthusiast that, you know, perhaps can't go and buy the real car. We saw that sold three or four years ago on the open market now. This particular car we're estimating between 900 and 1.1.